The Tibetan Terrier might not be a real terrier, but it definitely is the best friend and companion for us, for people. There are top 10 interesting facts about the Tibetan Terriers. Number 1. Origin Origin of a Tibetan terrier is in mysterious mountains of Tibet and Lamaist monasteries. They were bred by Buddhist monks more as a companion dog than a working dog, but they were also great watchdogs and they even knew how to herd a flock. Number 2. The Holy Dogs of Tibet the Tibetan terriers were considered a good luck charms and they were oftentimes given as gifts in return for favors. If someone gave you a Tibetan terrier as a gift, you should never sell it because that would mean that you are selling away the good luck. And they also believed that if you mistreat the Tibetan terrier, you would bring bad luck to whole village. Number 3. Not a terrier this breed might be named a terrier, but the truth is they are not related to the true terriers. The true terriers are descendants of dogs that were bred for hunt, especially for a vermin hunt, but as we already know, tibis were bred as companions and watchdogs. In the AKC, they do not belong to the terrier group, but to the non-sporting group. Number 4. Snowshoes the Tibetan Terrier was bred in harsh mountainous terrain which was very often covered by snow. That is why they are equipped with their flat and snowshoe like feet. They can walk easier on snow and it is easier for them to climb up or down from steep rock faces. Tibetan Terriers make amazing family companions and they are good with all the children. When they are around small kids, they should always be supervised because those small children do not know how to treat a dog properly. Tibbies normally, when they are socialized, have no problems with other pets. Number 6. Barking I already mentioned that Tibetan Terriers were also used as watchdogs and they were actually very good at it. They still have this guarding instinct in them and that is why they kind of like to bark at everything suspicious. They will most likely bark when someone is at your door or when they hear unknown sound. Number 7. Training Tibetan Terriers are not pushovers to train, especially because of their independent and kind of stubborn nature. But they do react well on reward based training and they are very intelligent, which means they can learn a lot of tricks with a consistent and patient leader. Number 8. Dr. Agnes Craig Dr. Agnes Gregg was a British female surgeon who practiced medicine in northern India and in 1922 performed life-saving operation on a Tibetan woman. She received a Tibetan terrier as a gift for saving the woman's life. She fell in love with Tibbies and started a breeding program in England. That is how Tibetan terriers got into the western world. Number 9. Size Tibetan Terrier is a compact and powerful dog that should be between 14 to 16 inches tall, which is 35 to 40 centimeters, and their weight should be between 20 to 24 pounds, which is 9 to 11 kilograms. The females are naturally a little bit smaller than males. Number 10. Health. Tibbies have normally great health, but as all dog breeds, they do suffer from some health issues. The most common are progressive retinal atrophy, hip dysplasia, and lens luxation, which is an inherited disorder in which the lens is improperly positioned in the eye. Tell me in comments what do you like the most about Tibetan Terriers and what is your experience with this dog breed. If you are new on this channel, consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check our Instagram, Facebook. Links are in the description. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.